Hey everybody, Randy Kurtz here. So, Happy New Year. And as we are into the new year, I usually like to start everything off by talking about things that we've talked about over the previous year or several years, and it has to do with just habits going forth. I uh, can't stress enough, awareness is key. We talk about things here that happen to musicians, uh, how we can avoid these problems or how we can handle them, but really awareness of the situation and trying to change things for the better uh, by making little changes and being aware of these things are going to help us more than anything and help to keep these problems from coming back as frequently or in some cases at all. So things like watching your posture uh, without making yourself too rigid and without making yourself slouching, whether standing or sitting are always important. Things like wrist angles when playing uh, are very important too. Trying to keep the wrist as straight or neutral as possible, but again, not rigid, because that would necessitate not only making things tighter here, which we're trying to avoid, but also then you have to put your arm out further to compensate for the stiffness of that wrist. Stiffness is is not what we want in the case of the wrist. We want it to be loose and we want to keep it in as neutral a position as possible, which we've talked about uh, many times before. It also goes for the shoulder, not too high. Um, any excess tightness anywhere in the body, we want to try to keep away from. So again, remembering to warm up uh, on the instrument to shake it out when you're not playing or when necessary, uh, to not stay in a ready position all the time, to just take a breath in and let out, things like this, and your awareness of them, because every time that you go to play, one of these things is going to happen, and by you noticing it and saying, oh yeah, wait a minute, <sighs> take a breath, oh yeah, wait a minute, <sighs> take a breath, lessen the angle on the wrist a little bit. Things like this just allow you to center yourself and kind of start over again and your awareness of these issues and understanding of them will keep that uh, in your mind and allow you to apply it to your playing. So that's all I got for this month, but if you're going to be at the NAMM show, please come find me at the Lace Music Products booth where I'll be uh, doing a little performing. I'll also be uh, having the, uh, the bass with the Helix Neck system on it, which is the bass with the curve at the top, which helps to uh, uh, keep one from having uh, injuries in their uh, wrist. Uh, I'll have it there to demonstrate, and we'll do some future videos on that as well. Uh, so. Always available, Randy Kurtz, D-R-K-E-R-T-Z at D-R-K-E-R-T-Z dot com. My website, D-R-K-E-R-T-Z dot com. And my book, The Basis Guide to Injury Management, Prevention, and Better Health, available at my site uh, or on Amazon or for the ISB uh, at their uh, bookstore. Um, still have some physical copies left. Okay, thanks a lot. See you at Ethernam. Bye-bye.